In addition to scheduling, I want to click on a piece of template content. So when I click on this next appointment template, I see it pop up here in my properties window. And everything looks the same in the top area. So the name, description, duration. Uh, is where you get beneath the scheduling area is where things change. So we get beneath scheduling, and now we have this editable fields area. The editable fields area is where you're going to customize any template within the Envision system. So whether it's uh, a news feed, uh, an appointment template, whatever it may be, any customization of that template is going to be done here in this editable fields. And uh, another thing to take note is if, if there's there's parameters that you want to change or the like uh, the changing of the font, changing the background color of a, of a template. If you don't see that option here in the editable fields, unfortunately that's not going to be something that you're going to alter. Uh, anything that can be altered will show up here in this editable fields area only. So for this piece of template content, I can put in a message. So it says, don't forget to make your next appointment. And I could also enter a logo if I wanted to. So uh, if I wanted to change the message, I would just highlight it change my message here and then I could scroll up to the top of my properties click my preview button and we can see where this piece of content uh, plays back to don't forget to make your next appointment if I'd added the logo the logo would appear here at the bottom left or bottom right of my screen and again just remember that any customization of any of our templates will always be done here in this editable fields area